In Chapter 26 of To Kill a Mockingbird, Harper Lee describes how Scout School starts educating about Adolf Hitler's persecution of the Jews in Germany. The incident fills Scout with various questions, stimulating her to conceptualize the idea of persecution. One of Scout's teachers, Miss Gates, lectures the class about the appalling anti-Semitism in Germany. However, Scout finds Miss Gates's comments paradoxical due to her prejudice against black people at home, which she expressed during Tom Robinson's trial. Following a thoughtful discussion with Jem, it becomes clearer to Scout that the townspeople, including their teacher, are not practicing what they preach. They are hypocritical, championing justice abroad while denying it at home to their black citizens. Meanwhile, Scout is still being gently tormented about her father's defense of a black man in court. Children at school taunt her about Atticus, but she practices restraint and heeds Atticus's advice not to react. The stark difference she identifies between the teachings at school about standing up against discrimination and the reality of her town's racial prejudice casts a dark cloud over her initial, more innocent understanding of her community. The chapter emphasizes that prejudice is not confined to just one race, religion, or region, but is a pervasive human failing. It shows the duplicity of Maycomb citizens and the ways in which they seem completely unaware of their own prejudices and yet condemn others. Harper Lee shows the contradiction in society where people deny their own faults and readily point out the same in others.